a woman was shot on camera, on surveillance camera, with her boyfriend. I think she was driving a Mercedes Benz. And then a, a white Lexus pulled up. After they parked, a white Lexus pulled up behind them, got on the side of them, uh, jumped out. And within seconds, man, there was no struggle. There were no words. It was just a scream, I imagine, from her. And shots, like a lot of gunshots. Not just one or two, just like, uh, I think it was four gunshots. No, I'm sorry, three. Yeah, three gunshots in total. They don't take anything, they just run back to the car. There's rumors, they're talking about it online, the comments that it looks kind of suspicious because, like I said, there was no struggle, they didn't take no, no uh, money, they didn't try to take the car, nothing. They just uh, got off, shot her, and ran back to the car. And people are saying, well, why, why isn't the, the boyfriend uh, going crazy? Like losing it, like this is you know his girlfriend, man. But you know some people react differently to certain situations. There's no way to know what really happened or why. But I'm gonna leave a link to the video in the description. But let's go ahead and check out the report from KTVU. You gotta let me know what y'all think. A woman was shot and killed after parking in Oakland's Little Saigon in what police described as an attempted robbery. Dr. Lily Su, 60, a dentist in Oakland's Chinatown, was attacked at about 2 p.m. near the corner of 5th Avenue and East 11th Street. Surveillance video shows her boyfriend pull up in their Mercedes to park on the side of the street. Within seconds, a white Lexus pulls up alongside them. Then screams and three gunshots can be heard. Sue died at a hospital. For some unknown reason the individual fired multiple rounds, striking the victim, said Oakland Police Chief Laurent Armstrong. This crime was senseless, unfortunate, and the Little Saigon neighborhood has been impacted by violence the last several weeks, the chief said, referring to another deadly shooting of an Uber food delivery driver. Burglaries and a shooting that left a woman injured as she was hit by stray bullets while sleeping. At a rally outside Oakland City Hall, President of the Oakland Chinatown Improvement Council said, I'm so sick and tired of hearing Asian Americans being targeted, referring to the city council, Chen said, I asked the council, I asked the chief, when is it ever going to stop? And there are solutions. I know there are solutions. Alameda County District Attorney Nancy O'Malley said, one of the ways to address this kind of crime is to have a presence of police in the neighborhood. If the police are there engaging, Council President Nikki Fortunato, who represents Little Saigon said, we know that this has not been happening for just a few months or years, it's been happening for decades. And we know this targeting of our community has to stop. Counterfeiting is a billion dollar business perpetrated by thousands of people throughout the world. Meet Kimo, one of those people. Kimo is a young man from the most dangerous city in America. After losing his job, he ventures into the risky business of counterfeiting to help relocate his family to a better place.